Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be unboxing this robot. Plus, later on, we we're going to do a review, and that would be it in a set of video as well. So, there's still two separate videos we're going to do later on. Obviously, reviews come up after a few weeks, and the set of video comes out right away. So, this is the robot. So, I'm going to turn around the box because I know a lot of you ask me for additional information. Maybe it doesn't say on the website, you guys are looking exactly for that. So this is the information you guys get around the box. Let me just go all the way around. And something I was surprised by this robot is that it only covers up to, I think, 500. Actually, no, I'm wrong. 200 and something square footage. So not 500. It was like 250 or something like that. It's right here. Yeah. So it only covers up to 250 square feet. So depending on your house, this maybe will not work because it's a little bit too small so just a heads up right there anyways we're gonna open this up and here's what we get inside the box so so this robot is actually really small i could compare it to let's say an ipad mini an ipad mini would be a little bit bigger than this maybe two iphones yep two iphones so brand new iPhone X, for example, two of those would be how big this is. And then thickness wise, well, that's that's a lot thicker than an iPhone, obviously, but an iPhone sideways would be around this size. So you can kind of compare it to that so you guys can get an idea of how big this is. Obviously this is an unboxing, so you guys are just gonna see exactly that, what's inside the box, what you guys are gonna get, how this looks like, and everything around it. So let me just turn it around. It feels almost like a toy. It's a little bit heavier, which is good. I don't like things that are not heavy because that means it's poor quality and they usually break really fast. However, this, this feels okay. The wheels, they feel squishy, kind of soft. Yeah, I can see these guys getting some grip. And if I press here, press here, yeah. So I can see how this will work as a robot. This will balance itself out. So I'm just gonna set this on the side for now. I'm gonna see what else is inside the box. So we have our manual right here. Okay, it's really important that you guys have this. I just put that back there. And right in here, we're gonna have a few other things. So here we go. Now, from what I know, these are not reusable, which is doesn't just just doesn't make sense, guys. Because <laughs> in the end of the day, this is for mopping, right? And you would need something reusable for sure, or else it's just the company being greedy, really, really, really greedy. I'm just selling you more and more disposable stuff and just contributing to pollution, making more garbage which doesn't make sense. Everything should be reusable, especially, especially when it comes to mopping. We want to wash these and reuse them again, but these are not it. So let's just look in here. What else can we find? There we go. And back here we have our battery. So if we take this out, so you guys can see right here, that would be over there, okay? It doesn't feel too light, not too heavy. It's pretty small. It's the same size of maybe, I wouldn't actually be surprised if inside of here there were two triple, not triple A, but double A batteries. <laughs> it feels like it's that small. I hope it doesn't just carry two AA batteries inside of here. I would not be surprised because I've opened this type of stuff before and they do do that a lot. And I hope they don't do that. I just hope they don't do that because then you could just do that yourself, right? So what I can tell you about the battery, it doesn't feel too light or too much weight to it. The more weight the battery has, actually it's the better and this doesn't have that much weight. So I could only say it feels so-so. So now that we saw what we get inside the package, we're gonna take a look around the robot. So we're gonna take this off. 
Okay, so we just took that cover off. We're gonna press on clean, and that will obviously turn this on if it had the battery, which we're not gonna place right now, because that's for the setup video. These guys, you should always take them out, obviously. I'm just gonna leave them there, whatever, for now. I'll round it, I already showed you guys the backside, and that's what it looks like. There's not much to the robot, it's pretty simple. I can see that this lid does come up. Uh, and right here, I can see maybe water goes in there. This right here, I think it's to release the pad. So if I press on it, if I move this, I can see how this is moving. So for sure that's for the pad. Right here, I can see that's for the water. So I'm just gonna lift it up so you guys can see. So right there, so there is a small filter right there. And there we go. So that's for sure where you guys have to fill up the water. Not 100% sure, but 99% sure about that. <laughs> Battery will go here for sure. Again, it doesn't feel heavy or light. I can see this being filled up with water. It's gonna put maybe enough pressure for it to do its job. I really hope I'm right about all these things I'm saying because there is a lot of weight here and that's because the wheels are here. So I'm hoping the water does get transferred over this way and it should. And that way there will be more weight here and that's where the pads go. So when this actually mops, there will be enough pressure for this to clean correctly. I know water would be coming out of here and that's why this hole is right there. So again, it's really, really small, only up to 250 square feet. So if you guys have bigger spaces than just 250 square feet, which is actually really small, then this wouldn't be the robot for you. I know there's another one, and uh, there's a really expensive one of these guys that's bigger that I'm gonna also do a review on and we're gonna see how that one does the job but anyways that would be it for this unboxing hopefully you guys have a good look at exactly what comes in the box how this looks like and later on we're gonna do a review and set up video anyways that's it if you guys have any comments questions you guys can write down here in the comments area don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you Oh, my God.